Hello YouTube, I am going to teach you how to cut your hair straight across. What you will need is a comb, any brush, and a pair of hair scissors. You can get a cheap hair at Walmart for like 15 bucks. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do, no matter which way you part your hair, is part your hair down the center here and here. I'm going to use my hair somewhat wet. I know some people cut their hair wet and some people cut it dry. It's just a personal preference. So I took this half and I have it in a ponytail and first I'm going to work on this half. And you may need a spray bottle in case your hair gets wavy like me or just water from the sink. Okay, so you're going to make sure that you brush it out really well and straight. And I only want to do like as little as possible. So I'm going to try to do like around like a half inch maybe. And I'm just going to kind of estimate it myself. You can use a ruler if you'd like. Okay, so first, going to start out with a chunk. Okay, I'm gonna go like this. I'm just gonna brush it out. And notice I'm using the thinner bristles right here. Okay, and then I'm just gonna go like this. Sure, straight across, and then it's actually maybe an inch. I'm gonna do about mm, half inch, maybe, yeah. So you see how see how nice that it, that was, just straight across. Then what you're going to do, you're gonna keep this and grab another section, but only take about this much of the section, just so that you can line it up really well. Okay. And then you are going to once again brush it out. Hold it up and then Make sure that you're facing st straight forward. It helps like keep your hair in line. You just don't want to mess this up. That's why I'm taking my time. Okay. Then you just flip it up as so. And right here I can see how short that is. So I'm just going to line that up along with that length. Just go trim, trim. Okay, just going to grab some more and just continue it, oh it's almost done, all the way until you get to the back. And if you're not sure, just go through it once again, and you kind of just straighten it like you would with a flat iron. And most of this is already perfectly straight. I'm just going to do a little bit of extras just because it won't hurt anything. Take a little bit with this once again. flip it up and also you can see how I trimmed my hair with a ponytail about six months ago it actually is that's actually only took like a minute or two it's a lot less time but I just really wanted to try this out just because I don't know it seems kind of fun but make sure if you're under the age of 18 your parents are fine with you trimming your hair yourself Then we just need to trim a little bit of this in the back. We'll be all set with this side.
going to wet it because it's not straight at the moment. A spray bottle would be ideal, but we have the sink right here, so that's what I'm going to be using. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Let me know if any of you have any video requests. The, le the back portion, I would say, is definitely the hardest. But what's nice is you just simply go like this, and you can do it right in front of you. The front of your face, you're not doing it from behind or anything. And then I'm going to go do the other side, and then I will show you how it turns out. Okay, so I just dried my hair and somewhat straightened it, and I love the way it turned out. I'm going to turn around, you guys can see the back view. And I also did trim my bangs a little bit. So if you're interested, if you're interested in how to trim your bangs as well, I'll put a link to my tutorial on how to trim your bangs yourself. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to like this video. You can also see the ponytail video I did where you just take your hair in a ponytail, drag it down, and then you cut it across. But I personally feel that this method was my favorite method so far for trimming my hair myself. Um, it's really easy, cheap, and yeah, I'm really happy that I tried this out. Bye guys, thanks so much for watching.